It's that special time of year, right? So it means we have to have a special sale to go with it. We mentioned that a few seconds ago. But how about looking at what it is, what the grade is, and what the price is, and then it's gonna be a mad dash for the few coins we have in stock. We're going at it, our 30th anniversary, Silver Eagle, 2016. Now, part of the reason why this was chosen tonight is this is also our anniversary week. This is our 30th year in the industry doing what we do, and we're very happy, and we thank you greatly for it. And the number one coin in the collecting market today is what? The Silver Eagle, the world's dominant silver dollars. We thought it would only be appropriate to hunt this one down for tonight's special sale. So in 2016, for our 30th anniversary as the Silver Eagle, dating back to 1986, this was the coin of the realm. The unique thing about this is the fact that the U.S. Mint struck 37 million coins. It was one of the largest strikes ever. The only one that was higher was 2015, the year before, which came close to 50. So because of that, we have to take a step back and look at this, the quality index of strike, what U.S. mints and other mints do in general. And that is, the faster they strike, the lesser of the quality, because it's not about quality, it's a byproduct. Quality is a byproduct. If they're striking slower because they have time, you get a stronger strike, a cleaner strike, and it passes on, and then boom, independent certification down the road is a stronger possibility. If you look at this year, 2016, as it references on the holder, the 30th anniversary, a bit different. We average about 300,000 coins right now. So let's go back a decade to this time frame, and we're looking at, well, four-tenths of one percent known, which means in just math, it's 150, half of what we see today. But when you look at today's numbers, we're about 15 million less per year in the low 20s which means they have better quality strike time. All comes together. Has anybody looked at that price yet? That's the deal, everybody. My competition has the 2016 coin, Silver Eagle, in a capsule. And they're at $79.95. Again, they made 37.7 million of those. And they're $79.95. PCGS is certified. Only 154,000 is perfect 70s out of that number, which is, again, a down year, which is a good thing for us. And our price is $59.95. Now, we did find one of our competitors with this coin. Not a first strike, but it was a PCGS 70, and the grade is the important factor to start with, right? They were at $89.95. So we're not kidding when I referenced walking into this that, again, 30th anniversaries are important. Every anniversary is important. Heck, every day we wake up is important, right? And it happens to be a perfect match. Our anniversary with the 30th anniversary of the U.S. Mint tying into one of the most significant coins in the history of coin collecting. Right? Wow. Now, that design, if it looks familiar to you, is because it comes from a coin that we used to circulate a little over three quarters of a century ago. The Walking Liberty Half Dollar was issued in 1916 through the year 1947. It was replaced by the Franklin, which was replaced by the Kennedy we still have today. Can you believe the Kennedy's been going 60 years strong? So that old Walking Liberty design, when we looked at this program in 1986, we wanted it to be an impact. So we went to the two strongest coin designs in the history of U.S. coins, dating back to 1793. And for the gold coin, we chose the St. Gaudens. Wise choice, beautiful looking piece. And for the Silver Eagle, the silver program, they chose the Walking Liberty design. Because both of them were renditions of liberty. It is our bullion coin to the world. So they took it, they copied it exactly. All they're doing is changing the date. So they blew it up from a half dollar to a dollar. And then John Mercanti designed the reverse you're seeing here. That reverse was in existence from 1986 through the year early 2021, and recently in the last five years has been replaced by Emily Domstra's Eagle Landing design. The Silver Eagle is our largest, 
40.6 millimeters. It is our purest. It's 0.999. Three versus 0.900 fine U.S. coin silver. It's a full ounce. It's the heaviest. 31.101 grams. Right? It's also the most beautiful silver coin ever made here. So they kind of copy that. That's four. Tonight we have the anniversary edition. That's five. It happens to be a perfect 70. That's six. And hold it. We're waiting. We're waiting for the best. The lucky eights, right? 59.95 is the best price out there, period. Uh, good question, Hunter. No, there is no limit. We have a set quantity for this presentation, for this conversation tonight. And when they're gone, they're gone. Silver Eagles in 70. Can you buy a 2024 right now in 70 with silver where it's at today for $59.95? I mean, my competition's at $79 to $100 for the brand new 2024s. And those are going to be released all year, and we could theoretically send them in to be certified all year, and we actually do. And those coins are more money on the marketplace. So how about getting a special celebration piece like this one at a crazy price, $59.95? Guys, let's put that 30-second clock up if we can, please. Lots of multiples, thank you. There is no limit. There's nothing wrong with having multiples of a good thing, in this case, a great thing. So here it is, our 30th anniversary Silver Eagle. A high mintage year, which means quality strike 70s are smaller. In this case, half of what we're seeing today. Regular coins are $79 in capsules. This exact coin without the first strike is 89 and tonight, as part of our special deal, we're just 59. Now that's a deal. That's a special deal. And it's exactly why we call this segment the Daily Deal.